everybody, this is Austin Anderson and Lawrence and Devin, and we are the creators of Alone. And you are watching Well That's Cool. <laughs> Hey everybody, this is Austin Anderson for Well That's Cool, and I'm with the creators of the Alone Experience. How you guys doing? Great, thank you. Good, good. So I just did the Alone, this is the Alone Diffusion, correct? Correct. Yeah. Yes. Alright, so this one is definitely different than the Halloween haunts that you guys do. Um, I don't even know how to explain it. Uh, if you could explain it in one short sentence, what the Alone Diffusion Experience is, what would you say? Diffusion uh, investigates how, um, was that short enough? Oh, you can, you can, you can, actually, you can actually be long. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's, it's basically about interaction and uh, light interaction and then going on from there. Human interaction, human, interaction, human interaction, emotion. And group interactions and emotions and... Yeah, it's definitely, like I said, it's very, it's very different. Um, can I ask you a question? Of course. How uh, you went through October before, right? Yeah. So how does it differ? You said it's obviously very different. How does it differ? I'd like to... Um, one, I think that uh, the difference between this one and the one I did, I did it the opening year, so I think two years ago. Um, it was very alone, and this one you were obviously with other people. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I think it was... This one was more about feeling and more about just like, like you said, interaction with other people. And the other one was about scaring the shit out of yourself. <laughs> so yeah, both of them are equally awesome. This one's just different. <laughs> cool. Yeah, we Two. definitely yeah. set out to be to have the, uh, usually our smaller events throughout the year. Um, we don't focus so much on, on on being solo, being alone. Those those ones, like especially this one, has a lot of group activities. Um, and uh, there are moments of being alone, so that's still a factor in it. But we don't focus on that as much as we do during the October show. Yeah, I think I think uh, this one explores group um, interaction more, very specifically. So the right. times when you're alone are s very specific, and the times when you're together are very specific. Exploring that dynamic. Sorry. Yeah. No. No problem. It's it's like I said. It's very it's very cool. <laughs> um, now, what sets you guys apart from any other haunts? And even if you guys uh, think of yourself as a haunt, we don't. Uh, we're definitely not a haunt. Um, so I don't necessarily know what sets us apart, but we uh, kind of use a haunted house structure uh, and then kind of go from there. But we definitely. Don't I think one know of the main things is a lot of haunts are very uh, kind of theme based, story based. Some are very plot driven, and uh, we tend to shy away from that. We focus more on concept, and we kind of strip away any narrative. Gotcha just to kind of get people a little bit more lost in themselves. So if you have a story to hold on to, that's, that's a different kind of experience. And if you don't have a story, you don't have an expectation, you don't have a guide to kind of help you get through, you're kind of on your own. And there's just it's just all about feeling and experiencing what's going on around you. And just to dovetail with that, we actually also uh, focus not solely on scaring you. So we focus quite heavily on trying to make sure that you have fun at times, are scared at times, uh, are you know, it seems magical, yeah, it's funny, it's exciting, like we kind of try to span the, um, the human well, experience, yeah, yeah. And, and basically we want you to be kind of confused and not know what's going to happen next, and, and so dropping the, the plot line and stuff is, is a good way to, to do that. Yeah, definitely, and I mean, like you guys said, the one thing that, I mean, keeps me interested with this is that you don't know what's going to happen. Like, if you go to really any other haunt, I mean, you kind of can just do a quick search on YouTube and figure out what's what you're in for. This one, I had no clue. <laughs> Fortunately, our fans are really uh, great in not, uh, you know, telling what's out there. Like, every time there's, like, a review or somebody posts on Facebook or some social media platform, they always say, I don't want to spoil it. To exactly. tell anything would be to spoil it. And so it, we've been very fortunate yeah. with our fans. Yeah, like I said, I don't want to give any, because that's, that's half the beauty, not knowing what's going to happen. Yeah. Where can people find you online, on the social medias, all the good stuff? <laughs> uh, AloneExperience.com and on Facebook, The Alone Experience. Instagram Alone Experience, Twitter Alone Experience. This is the three part for the Alone Experience over the next few months. There's there's four parts four total. Months. Yeah, this is one of the four parts. Uh, there's another one in August, one in September, and one in October. Awesome. Could you tell any, us anything about those haunts? Uh, uh, they all they all deal with with what happens when light meets an object. So this one was diffusion. Uh, so gotcha. the, the rest are refraction, reflection, and absorption. So we just did the Alone Experience diffusion. It was a uh, a thing. 
I don't want to say anything because like it's definitely a thing. We'll catch you guys next time on Well It's Cool. This is Austin Anderson. I'll see you guys later.